Hello everyone and welcome back to Final Fantasy 7 New Threat Mod. In the last episode, we went around and got Cloud all dolled up for Don Corneo. This time, we're gonna go ahead and go meet him. Uh, sorry for the late upload on this one, guys. Uh, I've currently been working up to seven days a week. Uh, and I'm on one day off. I haven't really been particularly been wanting to do anything. Uh, and I just got put on an 11 day work week, which is, I'm not gonna lie, it's gonna be rough. Uh, I'm currently three days, well, four days now into that. It's 4.40 in the morning. Uh, so I'm four days into an 11 day in a row shift. I figured, well, I'll at least try to record this to get it out to you. So yeah. Two light is coming through. Oh, uh, before I forget, I'm actually going to turn the game audio down. Because I actually got a copyright strike on the Airbuster episode because of the music, which sucks. Hey, ladies. I'm going to let the dot know you're here. Wait around. Wait here. Don't wander around. Now's our chance. Let's find Raven. <laughs> Sorry, I drank a lot of coffee. Like I said, it's almost 5 o'clock in the morning while I'm trying to record this. So I needed some coffee. So if I seem a little weird and hyper, that'd be why. Raven? Nice to meet you. I'm Lost Nova. Zorin's told me a lot about you. And you are? You're the one with Zorin in the park. Right. Was Zorin. Oh. Don't worry, we just met, it's nothing. W what do you mean? Don't worry. About what? No, don't misunderstand. I grew up with Zorin, nothing more. Poor Zorin, have to stand here and listen to both of us calling him nothing. Right, Zorin? Zorin? Alright, go here and get this first. Get an ether. And then we talk to the blue dress. Hmm? Zorin? Why are you dressed like that? What are you doing here? Never mind that. What happened to you after the fall? Are you hurt? Slow down. Let me answer. I'm just like this because there's no other way to get in here. I'm alright. Lost Nova helped me out. Oh, Lost Nova did. They haven't explained what you're doing in a place like this. Yeah, um... <laughs> just pluck my ears. I'm glad you're okay. Thanks, what happened? When we got back from the Sector 5 reactor, we saw a weird man. Duff Kefka caught him and squeezed some information out of him. That's when the Don's name popped up. Right, Don Corneo. Duff Kefka told me to leave the lech alone. But something's been bothering me. I see, so you wanted to get the one of the stories straight from Corneo's mouth. Well, I made it here, but now I'm stuck. Corneo's looking for a bride. Every day he gets three girls and ch chooses one of them, and then, well... Anyway, I have to be the girl for tonight. Sorry, but I overheard. If you know the three girls, there's no problem, right? I guess so, but... I only have two right here. No, last no way, I can't involve you. Oh, stretch for Raven to be in Daver? No, I don't want Raven in. It's alright. I grew up in the slums. I'm used to danger. Do you trust me? Yes. Thanks, Miss Lost Nova. Call me Lost Nova. Hey! It's time, ladies. The doll is waiting. I told you not to walk around, I tell you women nowadays. Hurry up, will ya? That is a very bad impression of whoever does that character's voice in Machina Bridged. Very bad. I guess I don't need to ask this, but the other girl is me, right? You're right. You didn't need to ask. No, 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 no. Okay, I actually have access to 
Raven's stuff here. Mm. Barrier all revive Osmos heal Earth. More sense lightning. Oop. Cover, fire, ice. I should put those down here. And then restore in the second all magic. <laughs> the Don's waiting in his room. <laughs> Alright, ladies, line up in front of the Don. Mm, good, splendid. Now let's see, which girl should I choose? Hmm? Hmm? Strawberry. This one. Maybe some grape. Hmm, blueberry. Oh, this one. Woohoo, I made up my mind. My choice of the night is... This slender... Wait, what? Don, you've got great taste. I got everything. How did I not get the thing? Like, even if I missed one, I still should have got it. What the hell? Shall we go, my pretty? Or is this supposed to be a mod thing? Because I'm fairly certain I got everything last time, right? Got the tiara, got the best wig, got the perfume, even got the makeup from the other one. <coughs> got the silk dress. Yeah, I should have been chosen. That's weird. We'll take real good care of you. This is all thanks to the big boss, Don Corneo. Three cheers to Don Corneo. <laughs> well, ladies, are we all ready? Whoa, slow down. What's the hurry? Why don't you stick around here and we'll treat you real nice. Ooh, can I get to the potion? Haha, <laughs> oh, no, Phoenix down. Oh, your eyes, they seem to glow. I'm all yours, baby. You look pretty good shape. Look at your tight little bod. It's more like muscles. I got ants in my pants. Wanna dance? Gonna take a chance. And maybe find romance. I'm flattered, but no thanks, because, 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 I'm interested in a bunch of scrubs like you. What a man. Oh, damn it, I don't think you'll get out of this. Get him. Wait the f- Ooh, should I just fuck her shit there? Hmm, tough choice. ba ba I thought Aerith joined you for this fight. Bikini briefs, that's the item mouse you're getting. Unless you purposely fail it in the mod now to go here, which I could see Sega Chief doing. Alright, because I had the blonde wig, the silk dress, the bikini briefs. 
Got the makeup, got the tiara, got the perfume. So yeah, I should not have lost that. I had all the best stuff. And then I got the extra makeup, so it should have been fine. So if any of you in the comments know why I failed that, do please let me know. The whole one of you that watches all the episodes. Or right, come on, what's the matter with you good for nothings? All right, come on, I'll show you how it's done. Come on. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Ow. 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 Yeah, because I honestly wasn't expecting to go through all this, so this might be a little longer than I expected to actually play. Bum. Might not actually go all the way through the sewers, might just end on the fight with Alps. Oh. Actually, I don't think you see these enemies in the entirety of the game unless you do this section. But so far, that seemed like a very... Yeah, that was a very unmodded fight. So I'm not entirely sure why I failed there. Zorin! You alright? Of course. You take me lightly, you're gonna pay for it. Woohoo! Come, come, don't be so shy. Yes. But, Mr. Don, I'd like you to explain something to me first. Of course, my dear. I'll take, it, take you through it slowly, step by step, so come on. No, that's not what I meant. No, stop. Just wait a second. Come, come. Can't wait any longer. Here comes Papa. Zorn. <laughs> I do like in the remake how he just fucking kicks him back onto the bed. What the hell? Who's there? I'm sorry, Don. What? Shut up. We're asking the questions now. What did your assistants find out? Talk, if you don't tell us. I'll chop it off. No, not that. I'll talk, I'll tell you everything. So talk. Man, find out where the man with the gun arm was. That's what I was ordered to do. By whom? No, if I told you that, I'd be killed. Talk, if you don't tell us. I'll rip it off. Uh, it was Heidinger, Shinra. Heidinger, the head of the peace preservation. The head of peace preservation? Did you say Shinra? But they won. Uh. What are they up to? Talk. If you don't tell us, I'll smash it. You're serious, aren't you? Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. I'm not fooling around here either, you know? Sinner's trying to crush a small rebel group called Avalanche, and they want to infiltrate their hideout. And they're really going to crush them, literally. We're breaking the supports, holding up the plate above them. Break the supports. You know what's going to happen. The plate will go ping, and everything's going to go bam. I heard their hideouts in Sector 7 slums. I'm just glad it's not here in Sector 6. They're going to wipe out the Sector 7 slums? Well, in the hell did I just say? <laughs> Zorn, will you come with me to Sector 7? Of course, Rick. Assist, why are you above my head? There you go. Just a second. Shut up. No, wait, it'll only take a second. 
What do you think the scum like me babbled on about the truth? Because I'm sure I'll win. Woohoo, right? Do you think you could ever fall for me? Oh, we had 16 minutes already, and there's nothing I really need to cut from after this episode. Alright, in the spirit of keeping it short after this cutscene, we'll end this episode. That's pretty much all I got time for, anyway. I wanted to do the entire sewers in this episode, but I don't think that's gonna quite happen. How are the preparations going? Ha ha ha! Smoothly, very smoothly. I assign the Turks to this. Mr. President, are we really gonna go ahead with this? What's the problem, Reeve? You want out? No. But there must be another way. We can't just drop a plate. Too many people will die. You saw the report, Reeve. Midgar's become unsustainable. In a few years, Michael Bloss will run completely dry. I understand that, but we, can't, but we can cut energy consumption in other ways. We slowly wind back our reliance on Michael, Midgar can survive. If we drop the plate, Midgar will be able to last a few more years. We'll also eliminate Avalanche and have an excuse to increase the rates to tackle the tragedy. Reef, just a f just flush your personal problems in the morning. The mayor's against us too. Ba -ba. Mayor, he just sits in this building all day, feeding his face. You still call that a mayor? I actually really like the mayor in the remake. The mayor's fucking hilarious. Now, if you excuse me, sir. You're tired. Why don't you go take a couple of days off and go somewhere? I did like the Kate set the Easter egg when they dropped the plate in the remake, too. We'll drop the plate and report that Avalanche did it. Then we'll send in the rescue operation care of Shinra Inc. <laughs> this is perfect. Ba bow. Alright. Uh, that's going to go ahead and be it for this episode. Um, I did want to do the entirety of the sewers today, but uh, like I said, I don't think I have the time. So, unfortunately, this is going to be it. So, in the next episode, we take on the sewers. See you guys then. Once again, I'm sorry for the late upload. Hopefully, I can get the other one out sooner. Catch you guys in the next episode.